The Maricopa County Sheriff's Office tells us two people drowned in separate incidents. Both were celebrating the Memorial Day holiday weekend with friends. ABC 15 Steve Couge was out on the river today as police helicopters and boats searched for the victims. What started out as a day of fun and relaxation on the Salt River took a fatal turn for two groups of friends. Around 3 o'clock, friends of Pete Contreras Jr. flagged on Maricopa Sheriff's deputies. They told them Contreras went under the water and never came back up. Because you can hear them on the radio talking the same that there was an emergency. We saw the police, when they started rushing out to the lake, so we obviously knew something was wrong, and um, we heard that someone drowned. With choppers in the air and dozens of officers on the water, they scoured the area for Contreras. Hours later, rescuers pulled him from the river. Officers say he died a short while after. But before deputies and rescuers could even catch their breath and deal with their first drowning, they got word a group of friends had pulled a second man out of the river. That man was later pronounced dead less than a mile downstream of where Contreras was found. Both men were in their 20s. Witnesses on the scene say there was a lot of risky behavior and alcohol being passed around the river. It was pretty crazy. Um, there was a lot of people you know, drinking a lot. So, I mean, you know, when you mix drinking and, you know, um, tubing, it's pretty dangerous. With the Memorial Day weekend just getting started and two deaths already, officers want to remind everybody out on the water to make safe, smart decisions, especially if there's alcohol involved, because they tell me they don't want to have to contact any more families with sad, horrible news this weekend. At the Salt River, I'm Steve Couge, ABC 15 News.